Hey Roll folks, it's great to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of Royal News and Analysis. But before we get started and move on to any further details, I'd like to say a massive thank you for always supporting our channel. And if you haven't already subscribed, hit that button and also the notification bell too, because we don't want you guys to miss out on any of the upcoming royal drama that is about to come your way soon. So we're going to get started in today's video. Prince Harry has no regrets about the bombshell revelations in his book and is extremely proud of his memoir sales, page six is told. Harry 38 was in great spirits as he spoke to fellow guests at Ellen DeGeneres um, at the surprise wedding vow renewal ceremony last week. One guest said that Harry who was joined by wife Meghan Markle at the bash, seemed very proud of the success his controversial memoir spare, which sold more than 3.2 million copies worldwide in one week. Harry said he was really happy about the success of the book and the reaction to it, the guest told Page Six. He said he had no regrets about any of the revelations and he's relieved to have got his story out into the world. There's been an amazing reaction, he said. The source added that Harry and Meghan seemed to be in extremely good spirits, but politely sidesteps questions about whether or not he's going to attend the coronation on May the 6th. Now, as Page Six has reported, the King wants them to attend, but this week another source close to the Sussexes told people magazine that they had not yet been invited. The former royals have become close with DeGeneres and De Rossi after moving to Montecito, California and Markle appeared on DeGeneres' show in 2021. Harry stunned the world with his bombshell book in which he spoke about his family and in page six reported that the royal family, particularly his brother Prince William, had left been left reeling from Harry's recollections. Among Harry's revelations were his infamous frostbitten penis episode accusing William of physically attacking him and alleging that his father called him a spare when he was born. Spare is the fastest selling non-fiction book ever according to the Guinness Book of World Records. So what do you guys think about this news? Do you think that Harry and Meghan are planning a new bombshell behind the curtain? Please show your thoughts in the comments below and until next time guys have a great day and we'll see you soon. Okay bye bye.